just like that, Obi puts it in. One, two, three, he makes it quick and easy. Fantastic goal, really it was. Makes the slide through, oh, he's got a man for a goal here. It's a stunning goal from Obi. What is going on everyone, my name is Ovi and welcome to a new FIFA 19 video on the channel. It's finally here guys, the secret controls tutorial has finally arrived on the channel, sorry for the delay. And before we get started guys, make sure to leave a like and let's try and get over 1000 likes for best formations tutorial. It's something that you guys absolutely need. There have been some big changes comparing with FIFA 18 and now we've got a few other formations that have entered the top. So remember, 1000 likes and Ovi will upload a best formations tutorial on the channel. Moving now to our secret controls and secret moves tutorial. Let's start with the manual pass. A fantastic new addition in FIFA 19, guys. I'm sure not a lot of you knew about it. Having assisted at passing is, as we all know, the best option. As the game at a high level is played extremely fast, guys, and you don't have time to always pinpoint the perfect pass. But assisted passing is not always the best option as it doesn't let you mix things up and exit a certain pattern of passing that your opponent is already expecting. Now you have a special weapon to make your pass even more accurate. You can make your pass fully manual by pressing and holding L1 R1 on your PlayStation controller or RBLB on your Xbox One controller and loading the pass button. This will give you the option to pinpoint perfectly the pass you want to do. For example here I used only the manual pass uh, which acted at first like a very very accurate through ball and then instead of uh, the ball going to Cavani I was able to direct it to a player positioned in a better area of the penalty box. It is a very tricky thing to master in FIFA 19, but if you do it, the manual pass is a game changer. Next on our list, well, maybe you've seen that uh, the goalkeeper thrower is kind of slow this year, but I got a fix for that. If you press R1 and the pass button on your controller, your throw will increase in speed, making it much more effective and great to start counter-attacks. Of course, you also need to load the pass button a bit longer in order for this kind of pass to not only have uh, power, strength, but also to cover bigger distance. Check the difference between these two examples. The first one is a normal throw with the goalkeeper using the pass button. The second one is a driven throw with the goalkeeper using guys the R1 and pass button on your PlayStation or RB and pass on your Xbox One. Uh, this way the speed of the pass is as you can see extremely extremely fast. Getting now to our third secret control in FIFA 19. Uh, some of you might know these ones because I've done tutorials about them but I'm sure a lot of you have missed them and need to find out about them. Okay, moving the goalkeeper only to cover the second post. This is a fantastic option. Trust me guys, it's incredible. You can move the goalkeeper to cover slightly more to the second post and prepare for a second post shot if you just press one time R3 on your controller. That's the right analog on your controller, just press it one time and check what the goalkeeper does. Just moves the feet a bit to cover the far post. This could prove to be extremely effective if you notice that your opponent has a tendency to shoot mainly at the far post. Uh, you can of course also control fully the goalkeeper, I've done a tutorial about it, by pressing uh, and holding R3 on your uh, controller while you are moving the right analog in the desired direction. You will see your goalkeeper listening to your commands and moving anywhere you want. A great trick if mastered perfectly. Now for an amazing move that will help you build up faster your attack the special long passes. These are driven long passes and they will spice things up when building up your attacks. You will have to press R1 or RB on your Xbox One 
plus the crossing button on your controller. The long passes will be a lot faster and you will be able to build up your attack at a higher pace. It's an incredible, incredible way, guys, to speed things up when building your attacks. I highly recommend you to use these type of passes. But for example, if the trajectory to your player is not exactly clean, you know, if you've got a lot of players, you should go with a normal long pass because this driven pass is a bit lower and might be sometimes intercepted. Next, we've got the disguised first touch one of my favorite moves this year it wasn't available in fifa 18 it is now in fifa 19 you will have to press and hold r1 on your playstation controller or rb on your xbox one controller and change the direction of your player to the left or to the right depending where you want to go to it is incredible to use when you've got a defender pressing you in the back and you want to change direction from there on you can do a shot or you can play an assist to your striker to your teammate it is as i've told you a very very nice addition in fifa 19. next trick on our list besides sending players to make a run which i am 100 percent sure you all know how to do you can also call players towards you by pressing R1 or RB in the direction of that certain player. Uh, good to use when your player is isolated and doesn't have solutions for a pass. It's an incredible, incredible move. It can make the difference between a successful attack and a failure in attack because without it, you might run out of passing options. Last but not least, the number one thing this year regarding attacking. I also done a separate tutorial about it, but I had to add it also here. That's how amazing it is. And in case you didn't see that previous tutorial, you don't want to miss this move. It's the most OP thing so far in FIFA 19. You will have to press and hold R1 on your PlayStation controller or RB on your Xbox One controller and then load the crossing button at between 3 and 4 bars the ball just flies at your player look at that just flies there and it's almost always a goal as i've told you it has already been done on the channel make sure to check previous videos this is something you don't want to miss uh, the goalkeeper throw in the disguise first touch the manual pass such great additions this year they will for sure make the difference between winning and losing this will be all for today guys i hope you've enjoyed the video i know for sure that these tricks will help you a lot improve in fifa 19. don't forget to drop a like and let's try and get to that 1000 likes mark if you want to see the tutorial with the best formations in fifa 19. thank you all for watching don't forget to subscribe for more fifa 19 videos on the channel follow me on twitter if you've got any questions that's the place where i tend to answer a bit quicker to your questions. My name is Obi and I'll see you guys later.